find the LCM and HCF of 36 and 63. To find the HCF and LCM, first we should do the prime factorization of each number separately. That is C. 36, 63. Okay, next. For this number, last digit 6, A1, so we take 2 here. The first number 3, a number close to 3 in 2 table is 2, 1, 2. 3 minus 2, 1, 1 carried forward making it 16. When do we get 16 in 2 table? 2, 8, 16. Now here we have 18, 18 is 2, 9, 18. Now 9 is 3, 3 is 9. Now here we have 3, 3 is a prime number, so 3, 1 is 3. Now the other number is 63, last digit 3, not A1, so this number not divisible by 2. Next to prime number 3, to check divisibility by 3, for that we should add the digits. That is 6 plus 3, 9. Is 9 divisible by 3? Yes. So this number also divisible by 3. So we take 3 here. The first number 6. When do we get 6 in 3 table? 3, 2, 6. The other number 3. When do we get 3 in 3 table? 3, 1, 3. Now here we have 21. 21 is 3, 7, 21. Now we have 7. 7 is a prime number. So 7, 1, 7. Now our HCF is... HCF is the product of numbers which should be present over here and also here. I repeat, HCF is the product of numbers which should be present in these two places, here and here. Okay. So now let us find the numbers which are present here and also here. Starting with the number 2. Do we have 2 here? No. Next number 2. Do we have 2 here? No. Next number 3. Do we have 3 here? Yes. So you cut 3 and write here. Next number 3. Do we have 3 here? Yes. So you cut 3 and write here. No more numbers are left. Therefore, our HCF is 3 into 3, 9. So, 9 is our HCF. Now, LCM is whatever number you got as HCF. To that, we should multiply by the numbers which we did not cut. What I mean is, here the number 2 is not cut. So, you cut 2 and write here. Now this 2 you cut and write here. Now here 7 is not cut so you cut 7 and write here. Now each number has been cut. So our LCM is 9 into 2, 18. 18 into 2, 36. 36 into 7. 7 into 6, 42. 2, 4. 7, 3 is 21 plus 4, 25. So we got 252 as our LCM. Am I clear?